Here, here lately, you guys, and, and, and please, my people, chime in. I need to understand what is going on with this sexist bashing that, that I've been seeing here lately. Like, I've been going to plays and sitting in, 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 in company of straight women um, and men. Um, I'm just listening to y'all beat it. Oh, like the battle of the sexes. It's like, it's like in 2022. I think it's corny. To no me, one yo. wants to just, it's not accept because accepting is just accepting. No one is willing to just be. You know what I mean? Like just, just let the relationship ride its, you know what I'm saying? Like take its course, like ride it out, see where it's gonna go. Um, I was telling, a, a crowd that um, if you get with someone and that someone is comparing your relationship to theirs, their, their cousin, or my my daddy didn't do that for my to my mama, or my daddy used to always do this for my, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Why you don't do that for me? My daddy did. They gonna be with your daddy. Heck yeah. I seen I seen a lot of that. Like you know what I'm saying? Like women who like oh like. My dad, you know, treated me a certain way, so like this is what I expect, nothing less, you know. And that's fine. And there's like a lot of dudes who, you know, they say like they mama did too much for him, you know, so now they can't really they don't really do what a man is supposed to do or they don't have all the what's it called that the assets that a man, you know, so to speak, in societal terms is, is you know, has. I've always seen, yeah, that like constant battle of the sexes. I think it's crazy, like when it goes like on either side of the fence because we both need each other. Mm -hmm. You know, mm -hmm. now like I agree, you know, women, the female, you know, sex is the more powerful one, you know, the more magical one because of course y'all create life. Uh, but at the end of the day, like, yeah, like it's, it's both of us for a reason. You know, so like when I see, especially on social media, like women like, oh, these men ain't shit, these men. And I hate that sentence, because what if you have a son and you say a man ain't shit, then your son ain't shit. But then like, I also hate like when them dudes be in the comments as well, well, women, this, women, that. I'm like, bro, come on, And if they have daughters, mothers, and sisters, that means their daughters, mothers, and sisters are the same bitches that they bitch in the bear. That's how I look at it. But, and I'm with you on that. So the battle of the sexes, I feel pointless. <laughs> we need women. Mm. My thing is this. Let's say, okay, now, first of all, congratulations on the Mary, am I right? Appreciate that. And then, I'm so, about to try this shirt up. You should, and it's going to come in your mouth. I'm going to cut it up. I caught it. He said he's going to cut it up. I'm going to piece it up. <laughs> I think it's funny. It's how man needs to churro. There it is, hell, right there. He gonna break it up. Uh -huh. <laughs> no, it do got like some. <laughs> there, feel the churro. Thank you. I didn't want to lick my fingers off. Like <laughs> my whole premise, my whole mindset about. One, just simply dating is overrated. The moment people start, well, in my opinion. I ain't gonna lie, dating is fun. Oh, dating is extreme. Adventure, yo. I would him. It's an adventure, it's a journey. But yeah, say what you're gonna say. No, 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 I'm, it, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get it right without, without being ugly. Um, <clears throat> so, with it being a journey, all the expectations of what your daddy did for your mama, or what your mama did for her boyfriend, or her, or her husband, or what your, all of those things should go away. I don't even understand how it's still being preached that he's supposed to take care of her and she's supposed to be at yeah. that. Like, that's the, like, I think that is the most deadliest so sentence you, in America. You don't believe in gender roles? No, I do not believe in gender roles. Okay. Like we, the man we, take we, out the trash, the woman cook and do the dishes. Now, I'll say this. I do not take out the trash, but that's my preference in my life. It's not because I have a son and he's big enough to go ahead and do it and take care of it, so I don't have to. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. uh, and that's, that's, that's why I don't want to do it. That's real. 
most women would say, well, I don't do it because I'm a woman. No, 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 I don't do it because I'm Miss Honey and I have a son that can do it for me. Yeah. Let's be realistic about it. And most people don't like my honesty and that's the truth. Um, gender roles suck nowadays because it's, it, times have changed. I'm not saying that the woman is supposed to always, I'm not saying that the man is supposed to always. It's just saying if we together, let's always together. If I, like, I don't understand how people get together and then want to get on each other's nerves and pick on each other and find all the goddamn time. Is, is that what you were looking for? Toxicity? Is that a word? Somebody, hear me out here. Toxicity. To toxicity. Come on, somebody. I only know it because that, what was that, Britney Spears? He's wearing J.C. Penney's, yo, and... Whatever, he ain't used to play that song. <laughs> right, because I, I make me know people are like, he jamming to Britney Spears, nah. I used to wear your J.C. Penney's back in the day. He played that song every day when he came out, yo. Man, that is crazy. But yeah, I just think... People do feed off that toxicity, though. They do. And then you have some that can get together. He understands her her path, her passion. Because mind you, before we got together, we was on a different, we was on our own path. We was going our own way regardless. So my path and my journey isn't supposed to stop because I got with you. I think that sucks for me to say, hey, honey, don't do, you know, whatever it is that you do anymore. You know, because, you know, we're together, I'm going to take care of you. I think that's foul. You don't have time for me because you, but I was doing this before you. So let's find a common ground to make this work versus trying to tell me what to do or control what to do. And it's some, some women like me that pass them, hey, okay, I'll do what you tell me to do. Some dudes won't, won't they? But you have to respect a woman who is out there getting it, making her own way. So when you come to the table, you not putting everything. I just want my girl to know what she wants to eat when she says she's hungry. You know what? <laughs> you know what? We can do everything. Just about everything else but that. Because I tell you. Man. We don't know. Quit asking. You hungry? Yeah. What you want to eat? I don't know. Starving. All right, bread. This baby just asked me a while ago. Okay. Thank you. Uh, I do like I that meme want... <clears throat> where like you write I don't know on a piece of paper and you put it on a plate. <laughs> Give it to <laughs> That's not nice. Right, since you want I don't know. That's not nice. <laughs> Oh, but no, I just really feel like like if you're out there dating, enjoy the process. Don't go go in with stupid expectations. Like I had a help of excited. So I had a young lady excited to tell me that she was dating a dude with a Tesla. Now let me explain. No two women are alike. For example, I don't give a fuck. I don't care about a Tesla. So what you drive a Tesla? I have a vehicle. So what you have a car? No, I have a car. No. I don't care what type of car you drive as long as it works and it gets you to where you need to be. And the coins you make, we gonna have to eat on. You know what I'm talking about? Because I'm gonna jump right in your bucket, in your boat. What if it's a moped? One of those, like. I'm gonna sit on the back and I'm gonna hold your waist. Thing. Not you a feel motorcycle, me? but one of them. Baby, look here. I used to date somebody that's so nice, door to door, and I watched them uh, grow. Baby, baby, build a family. I've I'm heard telling of that you, night I am a yo. real star from the bottom now. I'm here with you, chick. You I've heard me? of that night company. Everybody not like that. I'm also a a, a meet you where you are, chick. Because I'm establishing my own right. I'm not supposed to fade into the bed because I'm with somebody. So you guys just have fun and dating. Stop putting all these stipulations of if you don't, if you don't. And quit rushing my phones in relationships. You might be ready, but they might not be. Jesus. Well, Pepper's okay, I'm Cafe. Done. Pepper's Cafe in the studio. I'm done. I had to get that off my chest. Y'all quit bashing each other. Y'all know y'all like each other. Yeah. Go there and hunch each other it's in the wrong. corner. <laughs> It's like everybody complaining about everybody. Men complain about women. Women complain about men. But yet, yeah, babies are still being made. So, y'all like each other somewhere, you know. Speaking of babies, I need everybody that's out here, that's out here just throwing your thing and stuff, please go get up. I said to me, 